Do you want some free FIFA points? Yeah, I know you do. I'm giving away 4,600 FIFA points. All you have to do to be in with a chance of winning is like this video, comment down below and subscribe if you're new. If you want some FIFA 20 coins, make sure to go to the link in the description and check out Mule Factory. They've got a 24-7 service, they're completely reliable, and make sure to use the code LE5CHEAP at checkout to get yourself a discount. Make sure to go and check them out. Ah, <laughs> I have got a very, very interesting video today, and I could have clickbaited this a hell of a lot more. This is a method which will get you 1 million free coins in FIFA 20. Now, I'm not bullshitting. It does, but it's not as good as it sounds. Just just bear with me on this. Oh, what is going on, guys? Ellie 96 welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As I've just explained, this video is going to be a different one. It's basically going to be showing you guys how to get some free coins in FIFA 20. Now, I know a lot of you guys might be like, oh my god, free coins. Woo! It, it, yeah. <laughs> it, it's not... It's not as good as it sounds, honestly. This is probably going to make you about a thousand free coins, probably like every hour or something like that. It's not that good, but if you guys enjoy this video, just drop a massive, massive like on it. If you want to see as well a new method on how to get free coins from packs, I've done the silver pack method and I want to do a different method. If you can guess what it is, comment it down below. But if you want to see that method, make sure to get this video to over 250 likes. But guys, we are going to be jumping over to... I'm not sure what to show you first, to be honest. I, you know what? I'm going to show you guys my transfer list first. Now, as you guys can see right here, I have got myself a few cards on my transfer list. And I have picked up all of these for 200 coins. Now, a lot of you guys might be thinking, okay, cool. Bought some coaches. Who cares? And if I go over to my transfer targets as well, you'll see that I'm winning 18 of these cards. And I've won a couple of them as well. Some of them I've been outbid on, but to be honest, I'm winning the majority of these. And I'm probably going to win the majority of these as well. I really doubt that I'm going to get outbid on the majority of these. As long as these are 200 coins, I think we're all good. Now, you might be looking at all these and thinking, Lewis, why have you... Why have you bought these? What is the point in buying these? But I'm going to show you exactly what the point is. If you actually take a look at these cards right here, and you can either send them to your club or quick sell them. Now, I know what a lot of you guys might be thinking. 240 coins for a quick sell. Yeah, it... I've honestly not a clue. For whatever reason, EA haven't patched this this year in FIFA 20. And all of these cards do actually quick sell for 240 coins. However, we bought every single one of these cards for 240 coins. Thus making ourselves free coins in FIFA 20. Now, like I said, this is only going to make you like 1,000 coins an hour. But I actually did the maths on this. Now, it takes 10 minutes to make 1,000 coins per hour with this method that I'm going to show you. However, if you did this over the course of, say, like, I don't know, an average course of playing FIFA a day, like four hours or something like that, after school or after work or whenever, that would actually be 28,000 free coins per week. Now, considering that you actually get that reward from playing, like, division rivals, I don't think that this is actually too bad. And then I actually worked out if you actually started doing this today until next year, you would make yourself 1,456,000 free coins. So this is actually a method which will get you 1 million free coins. Now, I know that it is in a year, and that's why I was saying don't get your hopes up too much because it isn't the best method. But you can see right here, I'm quick selling all of these and making myself free coins. Every single card does actually go for more than what I bought it for. I don't have to put anything up on the market. I don't have to worry about it selling. I can literally just quick sell it and get these free coins, which considering it's just going to take me like 10 minutes every single day, it's going to take me like 40 minutes in total to do this every like FIFA session for four hours. And to be honest, I honestly don't really think it's that bad and we're winning all those right here. So I'm going to show you guys exactly what to do to do this method. What you need to do is jump over to the staff right here and you need to take a look at the head coaches, goalkeeper coaches, fitness coaches, physio coaches, and that is the only thing that you need to keep in mind. Go over to gold right here, and then go over to your max price and set it to 150 coins. Now, what you need to do is basically sit here for ages and scroll through all of these. Now, I know that it can be very annoying and time-consuming to do this, but like I said, it's going to take you about 10 minutes, if that. If you do it quickly, or if the market's like not as active, you'll get through it quickly. But, as you can see right here, we're up to around the 15-minute mark. Now, what you want to be 
you're looking for is the time remaining at the bottom to be around the 40 minute and that's when the rare gold cards will pop up. Don't be going for these non-rare golds because they're not going to quick sell for what you think but make sure to keep an eye out as much as you can do. Now you saw right here that there is one here, open bid 150 coins and you drop a bid on it for 200 coins and you do this with all the ones that you see. The best times to do this are when the market is sort of not really too active so maybe when everybody's in school and you could maybe get on your companion app that's probably a good idea or maybe if you do it through the middle of the night or whenever don't do this at peak times because I guarantee you guys it won't work make sure as well if you are watching this video be quick when you're going to be doing this because a lot of people are going to be trying it as well now basically what we're looking for is all the cards who have open bids but in addition to that as well what we're also looking for are cards who are actually just listed for 200 coins because some people don't realize that these quick sell for more and for whatever reason they just chuck them up on the market at like 200 coins and you'll usually find those within the sort of last 10 minutes of the market I can't tell you guys how long it really takes to get to the end it, it can take quite a while but like I said it's gonna be 10 minutes of your day max and who doesn't have 10 minutes and it's completely up to you guys how you use this method you can just use it to make the sort of a thousand coins in an hour that's still pretty decent for what seven days a week 7,000 free coins, it's not really too bad. But then on the flip side of it, you could do this pretty much every hour in one day and just get it all sorted in one day. It's only sort of the same as playing like squad battles and in my opinion, this is a bit more fun than playing squad battles. Considering how boring this is and how time consuming this could be, it's still more fun than squad battles. So we're getting to around the 59th minute and we could actually start to see some cards listed up just for 200 coins, but you can see right here that there's plenty of cards being popped up. The more active you are with this method, the more likely you are to actually get yourself some deals. As you can see though, it doesn't look like that there's too many being listed up for 200 coins. Every now and again, some will just get listed up for 200 coins, but sometimes it might take quite a while for you to even see something which is 200 coins. I've actually run out of cards though for bidding, but I think that's a good place to end this video as you can see though in my transfer targets I've started to win all of these cards as well I just want to assign them all and you know exactly what we're going to do we're just going to jump over to quick sell now and there we go 720 free coins easy 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 but let's make sure to let me know down in the comment section if you do try this method out I thought, you know what, I just wanted to make a video on it, to be honest with you guys. If you want to see that other free coins method as well, make sure to drop a like on this video. But, lads, this is Betty Six. This has been how to get free coins in FIFA 20. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Make sure to go and try this method out. Again, you can get loads of cards for 200 coins, like I showed you guys. You can get them on bid as well. It's really, really easy, so make sure to go and try it. But, this is Betty Six. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like on it. Comment down below. Subscribe if you're new. And I am off. Goodbye.